Welcome to Program Your Remote. Today we're going to be looking at a Toyota remote programming procedure that covers many different Toyota vehicles. If you're unsure what procedure your vehicle takes, you can visit our website, programyourremote.com. So let's get started. First thing we want to do is make sure the key is out of the ignition and the driver's door is open. You want all the other doors to be closed and unlocked. Now we're going to take the key and without turning, put it all the way in the ignition and all the way out. Now, using the switch on the driver's door, we're going to do a cycle of pressing lock and then unlock five times. One, two, three, four, five. Now we're going to close and open the driver's door and do the five cycles again. One, two, three, four, five. Now we're going to take our key, put it in the ignition, and go from on to off and remove the key. The door lock cycled, indicating the vehicle is now in programming mode. So we'll grab our remote and press the lock and unlock button at the same time. Now press just the lock button for about two seconds. One, two. Door lock cycled, indicating this remote has now successfully been programmed. If you have no other remotes, you can skip this next step. If you do have another remote to program, you'll repeat the previous step, pressing both the lock and unlock button once and then just the lock button for about two seconds. One, two. Door lock cycled, indicating this remote has now been programmed. If you have any other remotes to add, you'll continue that previous step for each remote. Once you're done adding remotes, you can close the door. That's gonna exit programming mode. Now let's test the remotes. Those are working remotes. Thanks for watching, everyone.